Okay, here's everything that happened in medicine and healthcare today, and it is January 12th. A JAMA analysis found that one out of four patients was taking a dementia-related medication that was likely unnecessary. After reviewing the medical records of thousands of patients, they found that there was either no clinical reasoning for it or that they were taking medications that were against the recommendations. It's not exactly clear why, it could just mean that providers forgot to put a clinical reasoning or it could mean that they're taking medications that they shouldn't. A new study in the American Journal of Pathology finds that microglia, which is like the brain's immune cell functions, are a potential key driver for why we have emotional reactions to binge drinking. In mice models, they found that when mice were exposed to binge drinking, they found that microglia was hyperactive and inflammatory, which often caused issues with anxiety and other mental issues. When the mice were genetically modified to prevent this, they found that they actually had improvements in the symptoms. A major study out of The Lancelet in the UK tracking over 1 million people found that COVID-19 vaccination hesitancy slowly declined over time. And lastly, a new representative study out of JAMA finds that individuals who were having medical debt were more likely to be recognized as homeless the next year compared to those who were not. Do a full breakdown of all these articles with the link in my bio to my Substack. Yes, if my voice sounds a little funky, I'm recovering from a pretty severe sickness and I barely have my voice, but just trying to get a video out. Anyways, I will see you tomorrow for the rest of the news.